Welcome back to the Red Carpet re -up. In today's video, we're diving into one of the biggest rap feuds of the year, Megan Thee Stallion versus Nicki Minaj. We'll break down how this beef started, the diss tracks that were exchanged, and where things stand now. So if you're curious about what went down between these two rap queens, make sure to stick around. This whole back and forth kicked off earlier this year when Megan Thee Stallion dropped her track, Hiss. The song was a response to what seemed like subliminal shots from Nicki Minaj in previous songs. According to Megan, she still doesn't understand what Nicki's issue with her is. She even told Billboard in a recent interview that she has no idea what could be reconciled because she doesn't know what the problem is in the first place. But instead of backing down, Megan chose to look at it in a positive light. She feels like if people are taking shots at her, then she must be doing something right. In her words, if people feel like I'm somebody to aim at, then I must be pretty high up. Now, let's talk about the diss tracks. In 2023, Nicki Minaj took a pretty direct swipe at Megan on her song FTCU from Pink Friday 2. She referenced Megan's shooting incident with Tory Lanez, rapping, Stay in your Tory Lanez, bitch. I'm not Iggy. Megan didn't take this line down. Just a month later, she released Hiss, where she fired back with a thinly veiled reference to Nicki's husband, Kenneth Petty, and his criminal past. The line, these hoes don't be mad at Megan, these hoes mad at Megan's law, was a direct hit at Petty's attempted rape conviction from 1995. Nikki wasn't done though. She released another diss track called Bigfoot, where she threw in more personal jabs, including taunts about Megan's late mother and the Tory Lane shooting. The feud eventually cooled off, but not without some backlash. Nicki Minaj faced widespread criticism for her harsh and personal attacks, especially the lines about Megan's mother. Many people, including Charlemagne the God, felt that Megan came out on top in this beef. Megan, on the other hand, didn't seem phased by the drama. She even had more bars for Nicki on her June album, Megan, although Nicki has yet to respond. So what's next for Megan and Nicki? Only time will tell if this beef is truly over or if there are more diss tracks on the way. But one thing's for sure, Megan isn't backing down anytime soon. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this breakdown, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any updates. Catch you in the next one on the red carpet re-up.